Maybe we'll mark there instead. Mighty King Bowser, I've been looking for you. A report you'll eat your evilness. Mario defeated the Goomba King. He's headed or heading for Toad Town now. What? Unbelievable. What was Goomba King thinking? I used the Star Rod to make him a king because he begged me. And Mario whips him so easily? What a win. Hemi Koopa. Uh, you are sure that Mario can never defeat us, right? Please, please, your vileness. Try to be calm. Goomba King is small time. I had a feeling he'd, he'd fail. It doesn't matter, because while you hold the Star Rod, you are definitely invincible. Uh, you could beat Mario with one claw tied behind your back. Yes, yes, very good. By the way, Kami Koopa, uh, those star spirits we captured don't have any way of giving Mario their power, do they? Please, don't worry yourself. Each is held separately. And each is carefully guarded by your hand-picked subjects. Even Mario can't save all seven of the star spirits. Who's the closest star spirit to Mario? It's the one at Koopa Bros Fortress, right? If Mario somehow reaches there, can the Koopa Bros defeat him? King Bowser, you mustn't worry. Hiya! Here come the Koopa Bros. Uh huh. Oh yeah, we're the coolest of cool. Yami Koopa, are you sure these guys can get the job done? The Goomba King was gigantic, and even he couldn't beat Mario. Get real, King Bowser. Yeah, the Goomba King was huge, but he was a total Wimpola. We're nothing like him. Uh, see? Uh, see? What we've got going on is the power of teamwork. Together, we can put the hurt on Mario in seconds flat. Excellent. That's the spirit. Sell it, Koopa Bros. Show our king that special attack you do so well. Yes, ma'am. Ready, everybody? Ooh. This is ooh. How'd you like it? King Bowser? How was it? Oh, yeah. Excellent. Really? I'm not easily impressed, either. Mario won't have a chance if you finish him with that attack. We'll take him, King Bowser. By the way, my Koopa Bros, about the captured star spirit uh, I've locked up in your fortress, who's guarding him right now? Uh, nobody, sir. You know, we're here, and so... You idiots, use your heads. Get back to the fortress and guard that star spirit. Look. You fool! Sleepy sheep. If it works, makes all enemies sleep for a little while. If it works. Never a good sign. Hello there. Hammer throw badge hits one enemy with a hammer no matter where the enemy is. Oh. We have some badge points. Oh, uh... oh, but it costs two. Oh, and it uses two FP. Well, might be a while before I decide to choose uh, badge points. I definitely don't want to play this entire game with 10 HP. Mario, I'm so glad you're okay. The town uh, is, in, is in an uproar. The princess kidnapped. The very castle uprooted. It's Bedlam. I really don't know what we can do about all this. Please, Mario, save her, her highness. 
Oh no, doom, danger, Princess Peach's castle has flown up, or flown away up into the sky. No castle, horrors, only a hole remains. Our beloved castle, where is it? Spread the word, outrage. This is outrageous. Ooh, did we get to recruit Luigi too? I wonder what my brother Mario is doing right now. Whoa, Mario, it's you. Good to see you. And you're alright. After all that castle craziness, I was really worried about you. I ran outside just as the earthquake started, so I managed to escape in time. <laughs> oh, and who are you? I'm Gumbario. Nice to meet you. I see. Great. Just great. You're on an exciting adventure with Mario. Talk about unfair. See, someone has to look after this house. So I can't leave. Oh well, take care of Mario, okay? Oh, we don't get we don't get Luigi. The disrespect. Good luck, Mario. You just have to save that princess. Why is Luigi always getting disrespected? This doesn't look ominous at all. I really wonder what that is. I should maybe use that against an enemy. There's 80 badges, 160 star pieces. Interesting. box where letters addressed to Mario go is empty right now. You're at peak strength. You want to go to bed? Absolutely. I wanted you in my party. Oh, salutations. You are Mario, are you not? Of course, I know who you are. I'm the wise toad. Russ T. Pleasure meeting you. Uh, as you can probably tell, I love books and read all the time. Because I'm so well read, I know all sorts of interesting facts. Whenever you visit with me, I'll be happy to share all my knowledge with you. Oh, you're talking to me because you create knowledge that only my intellect can provide. Then how about this? Uh, so it is told that far away, at the very top of the sky, there exists Star Haven, where stars make their home. In Star Haven, there's a treasure called a Star Rod. According to legend, it was made with ancient magic. There are said to be stars that are particularly strong and good-hearted. They are called Star Spirits. Using the magical star rod, these star spirits grant the wishes of everyone in this world. That's why, when we make a wish to the, to the night sky, and it comes true, it's all thanks to the star spirits and their star rod. If there's anything else you would wish to know, please feel free to ask me. Oh my. How am I supposed to get that? Boy, y'all got a star fragment out there. Busy, busy. The room doesn't get tidied up when my darling's at home. Earthquake. Uh, when the castle flew away was terrifying. Everything was shaking, the ground, the houses, I fell right over. It was so horrifying that I just happened to forget if it ever happened. My dad works at the castle, so he's not at home usually. 
now that the castle's gone. Er, but now the castle's gone, so he's at home. When I said I'm glad because Dad's at home, I got scolded. What's up with that? Princess Peach was kidnapped, so I'm going to save her. But Mom told me I had to be a good boy and stay home. How come? Because you ain't ready. Ready. Sometimes people out there just need to be checked. Castle was taken away and Princess Peach was kidnapped. These are dark days. Everyone in town is suffering and yet my heart cares for nothing but you, my sweet. Does that make me wicked? My heart is the same, my love. It cares for you, none other. We are both wicked toads. <laughs> hey Mario, did you know you can carry up to 10 items? When you can't carry any more items, it's a good idea to go to a shop like this and ask them to hold items for you. You can even claim the items at any other shop. Pretty convenient, huh? How do they do it though? Peach's castle flew away. How could such a thing happen? What? What'll become of Princess Peach and the others who were in the castle? I'm scared, I'm scared. Oh, Felissa. Felissa T. Jeez. Am I so scared? Peach's castle flew away. How could such a thing... Oh. Those are... All three of them, okay. Oh. You don't have it? The degree, Mario. The degree shows how strong you are. I have it. I fought at the dojo over there and got it from the the master. I am one bad toad. <laughs> Mario, have you gone back to your house yet? Luigi was wondering how you were doing. You can go home through that pipe in the front of the main gate over there. You can enter the pipe by standing on the edge and pushing down on the control stick. Hey, why don't you give it a give me a tour of your house someday? Sorry, dog, I'm busy. Boy. Above us, on the top floor, is a dojo. Uh we are here, always training at the dojo. Unless our master isn't here, in which case the dojo is closed. A letter just arrived saying the master will return soon. We will train again soon. I'll take that. Hopefully uh, there's not multiple items per... per tree. Like, ah, uh, you know, hit this tree 40 times and you get something. The left of our castle caused great or the theft of our castle caused great destruction here. The worst of it happened in the center of town. It seemed to rain wood. As a result, we can't get to the southern part of town. The train station, the port, many important things lie south. Not being able to get there is a great inconvenience to me and everyone. To me and everyone. Old Town Newsflash. Princess Peach cap uh, kidnapped. Castle uprooted. A few days ago, Princess Peach's castle was stolen. She was inside and presumed kidnapped. The whereabouts of Princess Peach are unknown, and where the castle once stood, there is now a gaping hole in the ground. According to witnesses, the castle rose into the sky. As soon as we get new information, we'll post follow-up reports on this board. Keep it locked. The building with the spinning roof is Merlon's house. He's weird. He also happens to be as stubborn as a mule. He rarely comes out. As weird as he is though, his talent is no joke. He can read the stars. He even predicted that you'd come back safe and sound. Predict the stars, you say. Is out. 
Uh, do you see that blue pole in front of the post office? That's a road sign. You can find out uh, what's where in Toad Town by checking out the signs. Uh, what am I telling you this for? I'm sure you know. Uh, it's smart to read all the signs you see. Of course I know. I've been reading them all. Alright, Peach's Castle, Pleasant Path, Port Station, Main Gate, Post Office. Can I like to mail myself, please? Greetings. The name's Paracary. Paracary. If that's a pun, I don't, I don't get it. Uh, I deliver letters. Yes, hello. This is the post office. You can read any letters that arrive for you or for your other party members. Please drop by now and then to check and see if you received any mail. Well? Oh, you seem to have some mail. Which one would you like to read? Uh... It's something... Letter from the Red and Blue Goomba Bros. Here you go. Goombario. Uh, you were a lot stronger than you looked. We figured you were just some punk Goomba hanging around with Mario. Anyway, you proved yourself to us. And you showed us that being good is as important as being strong. So, when you come back, do you think maybe we could be friends? Please say yes. We'll be waiting. Red and blue Goomba Bros. We'll keep the letters for you. Come, by, or come on by any time you want to read some letters. Wow. Oh. What a change of heart. Hey. Hey. What are we doing on HP? We are full HP. Oh, those are some evil toads. Look at Minty, always with the flowers. She's as pretty as a rose. Just watching her from a distance makes me happy. Water and dirt, sunshine power, beautiful blooms, beautiful flowers. Hello, my name is Minty. Please enjoy the beauty of this flower garden. I've heard there's a lovely flower we don't have here. Supposedly, uh, bub olbs have the only known seeds. This is what a bulb olb looks like. If you find a bub olb, could you get the seeds for me? I'll plant them in this flower garden and raise them lovingly. Princess Peach's castle uh, was here just a little while ago. Wow, I was in the I was in the castle when it started to shake, but my lightning quick feet got me out. I know Luigi made it out along with maybe a few others, but everyone else was taken. Who wants some Debo? What was that? Got the flying across the, sc the screen. Green Star Summit. Oh. Guess this is where I'm supposed to be. Looking for something? Drop by Merlovy's place. Love you. Ah, oh, my my. Hello there, Mario. The spot is a little tight for fortune telling. If you want your fortune read, talk to me over the counter. Oh my my, I foresaw your arrival, Mario. My name is Merlovy. Mer Merlovely. Merlovely. 
Uh, I'm a stunning fortune teller. My noble calling is to read fortunes while looking absolutely ravishing. Uh, I, I can help you find what you seek. My twinkle star here will show me all that's hidden. Tell me, shall I read your fortune? Sure, what? What I want from that right now. I'm the famous Merlot of Shooting Star Summit. I collect star pieces. I have the biggest collection. Mister, you have any star pieces? If you do, I'll swap some cool badges for them. How about it? Which badges do you want to swap for? Changes the sound effects when Mario's attacking. That's not worth a badge. Uh, the more damage Mario tanks, the more coins he receives. Keeps you from being hit by a first strike. Ooh. Makes enemies fail to attack Mario every once in a while. Mario from poisoning and dizziness. Uh, restores HP automatically during battle at a slow rate. Mmm. Mmm. We're gonna have to save. Or probably happy flower. Makes it possible to see your enemy's HP. Ooh, I like that one too. Battle makes it makes most enemies who touch Mario take damage. I like that. After beating an enemy, uh, makes more hearts appear than usual. I don't know what that means. Being an enemy makes more flowers appear than usual. I don't know what that means. Increases Mario's attack power by one, restores one HP per turn. Hmm. After battle, Mario gets twice as much money. Uh, during battle, saves one FP every time you attack. Saves? Interesting. Increases Mario jump and hammer attacks powered by one. Alright. Oh, oops. I am definitely saving. Uh, hmm. Saving my, uh, my coins. Uh, my pieces. There's 180 of them. Early I can find 10 to 25, right? the fat loots. There's my fat loots. That gives me five. Minimum, I want five more. Maximum, I just need... Uh... Six? No. I need 25. Look at this guy. How can he see me? Welcome, Mario. We've been waiting for you. We're the seven star spirits. Our job is to grant the wishes of good people from our home in Star Haven, a place high beyond the sky. We're going to tell you something incredibly important. Please listen carefully. The other day, Bowser and his followers invaded our peaceful Star Haven. 
They stole our prized treasure, the Star Rod, which we've cared for since the beginning of time. The Star Rod is powerful beyond belief. It can grant any wish. For as long as we can remember, Bowser has been making wishes like, for instance, I'd like to trounce Mario, or I want Princess Peach to like me. Of course, stars ignore such selfish wishes. As a result, his wishes were never granted. Bowser, that fiend. When he found out uh, that we were ignoring his wishes, he came and stole the Star Rod so he could grant his own wishes. He seems con uh, content right now, mainly because he defeated you and captured the princess. Soon enough, though, I fear uh, he will wish for more, and when uh, then terrible things will happen. It is the responsibility of the Seven Star Spirits to keep the Star Rod safe and use it properly. We must, uh, we must get the Star Rod back from Bowser and return it to its rightful place. In order to do this, Mario, we need your help. Sadly, right now you are not strong enough to challenge Bowser. He has made himself all-powerful by making wishes with the Star Rod. He is terrible to behold. Once we seven Star Spirits are reunited in Star Haven, we can give you the power to fight Bowser even with his newfound strength. With our help, you can prevail. Mario, we are... We are... Alas, we've nearly exhausted our power to talk to you. Although it looks like we're, uh... We're there beside you. It is only an illusion. We're using all of our strength to communicate uh, with you over a great distance. But even now, our strength is fading. Uh, we've been caught and are being held by Bowser's followers in different places throughout the Mushroom Kingdom. Please, Mario. First of all, you must rescue us. In order to take the Star Rod back from Bowser and save Princess Peach, we need your help. Please, Mario. You are our last hope, and we will. Mario, looks like the things are, are looks like things are a lot more serious than I thought. Do you think the princess is going to be all right? I'm really worried about her. Niffle. Mario's probably hurt. Everyone's in prison. Mushroom Kingdom will be destroyed if things continue the way they're going. Something must be done. Only somebody could help me. My dear Princess Peach, how are you doing this fine day? No use waiting for Mario this time, my dear. We're so high, ab high above the sky right now, even Mario doesn't have a chance of reaching us up here. You know, Princess, as long as I have this Star Rod, uh, no one in the Mushroom Kingdom can touch me. You know the power that grants everyone's wishes. It's mine. Isn't that just wonderful? Imagine what it's like down in your kingdom. Your subjects must be so upset because their wishes aren't being granted. Oh, how delightful. They deserve it for the way they've treated us Koopas over the years. If you, you know, want anything, all you need to do is ask me, Princess. I can grant wishes. Of course, I only grant requests I like. Anyway, think about it. You take care, Princess Peach. Enjoy your stay here. You want yourself, Princess. You better not cause trouble. You should wish for a frying pan. Oh, please. Only somebody could help me. Huh? It's Lil Star. Hello, Princess Peach. Pleased to meet you. My name is Twink. But you're... You're a star kid, aren't you? How'd you get here? I came from Star Haven to grant your wish. It's our job to grant wishes, you know. Oh, you came because I wish that somebody could help me. 
Yes, of course. Oh, that's just great. Thank you so much for coming. Here's my wish. Go right now and take that star rod back from Bowser, okay? Think you can do it? <laughs> uh, sorry. That's a little much for a novice star like me. Maybe one of the honorable star spirits from the Star Haven uh, could grant a wish like that. So sorry. Please ask me for something easy. Something a small star can do. Then can you take me away from here? Everyone in my castle has been captured, and I have to save uh, them all as soon as possible. Oh, I'm sorry. I can't grant that wish either, I'm afraid. Actually, I just got called up to the sky a day ago, so I can't do big wishes yet. If I were a more splendid star, maybe I could actually help. It's alright. Don't be sad, Twink. Mario will definitely do something to save us all. He's probably coming right now. Oh, Twink, do you think you can find Mario? I want you to give this to him. This is a lucky star, isn't it? Okay, I'll do it. Princess Peach, I'll fly to the Mushroom Kingdom just as quick as I can. Oh wait, Twink. Uh, wait one second. Can you also... Please tell Mario that. I'm fine and you shouldn't worry, okay? Can you tell him that? Of course. I'll tell him your exact words, Princess Peach. Definitely. Now don't despair. I'll be back soon, so stay safe until I return, okay? Mario, where are you? Oh, sorry. So oh, sorry. I'm in a huge hurry. Oh, it's... You're Mario, aren't you? Thank the stars I found you. How do you do? I'm Twink. Princess Peach asked me to bring something to you. Ah, uh, yes, here it is. Uh, this is it. Take it. My shape pendant lets you use the action command. Whatever that means. That's the lucky star from Princess Peach. Uh, now, now that it's yours, you can use the action command. May I take a moment to explain what the action command is? Sure. Hey, let me explain. Let me see. Hang on. You, behind Mario, would you mind helping me demonstrate something? Me? The name's Goombario. Of course I'll help. Well, Mario and Goombario, let's begin. First, Mario. Choose the jump command and then decide the enemy you want to attack. Uh, once you decide on the enemy, uh, the explanation of the action command will appear. Right now, just before stomping the enemy, press A at this exact moment. Nice. When you see nice appear, uh, it means you've successfully used the action command. When you do, you'll increase the uh, amount of damage you do. Uh, okay, now this time, Goombario, you try to attack Mario. Okay, here it comes, Mario. Right now. Press it right there. Yes, you successfully used the action command. This will reduce the amount of damage you receive. Often, you'll have to use different techniques to make use of the action command. It depends on the attack. Try attacking by hammer. Press the left stick and release. Oh. Once you choose an enemy uh, to attack, move the control stick to the left. And move the control stick to the left. Flashes. Okay, interesting. Alright, you successfully used the action command. 
Well, Mario, do you understand the ins and outs of the action command? Let's practice a bit. Make sure you've mastered how to use it properly. Good dog. You don't need practice anymore. That's our Mario. You're a quick learner. Well, I guess that's about all I can teach you. All right, I can finally do the thing. Uh, once you understand how to use the action command properly, you'll be even more powerful. Terrific. You'll be much tougher in battle now. Here you are. What? It can't be. Were you following me? What a foolish star kid. I knew that if I followed you, I'd find Mario. If I defeat Mario right now, I'll be famous. I'll tell Kami Koopa. He'll shower me with praise. He'll give me a raise. Here I come. This is a Magikoopa. Magikoopas use magical rods. And attack power 3. Magic attacks are no joke, Mario. You'd better take these guys seriously. Nice! Well done, Mario. You're as strong as they say. Uh, I know that you'll be able to defeat Bowser. I'm going to return to Princess Peach's side. I'm not strong enough to really help her, but at least I can tell her you're okay. Well, Mario, see you later. Guess you're not going to give us that message. Oh dear, I almost forgot to tell you the message from Princess Peach. I'm alright, so don't worry about me. That's exactly what she said. I get the feeling, though, that she's very lonely. Anyway, I'll do my best to help you both, or the both of you. But please, be brave. You must save Princess Peach. Okay, bye. There he goes, back to Bowser's castle. What a brave little guy. Okay, Mario, let's get down to business. Let's get down to business. Oh, Mario. Merlon was uh, looking for you. He lives in that house with a spinning roof. He asked me to tell you to go meet him in his house. I was just about to go look for you, but here you are. It's rare for Merlon to call somebody over to his house. He's a bit eccentric, even when he has visitors. It's uh, rare for him to come out of the house at all. Yeah, but I'm looking for a save point. Come on, out. Pop on the door. Why do you keep on knocking? I'm telling you, he's out. <laughs> The, why is someone sleeping in front of my house? Wait a minute. That face seems very familiar to me. Oh, maybe? No. Yes, it must be your Mario. I've been waiting for you. You should have come earlier. Well, you're here now. Come in. I uh, should have slammed the door on Goombario. Where to begin? My name is Merlon. I'm a wizard. Uh, when I was reading the stars the other day, an oracle came to me. What I discovered is very important, and it concerns you. But before I tell you about it, uh, there are other things of which I must speak. It is a very long story, but I'll try to shorten it. Where should I start? It was in the old days, one of my ancestors was up on Shooting Star Summit, and as usual, but one day it happened, suddenly, a great uh, appeared and I, standing face to face. Then the far away, the pious, was raising me up, was amazing. I was still so young then, I believed in, but our hearts were. And 
it in, so... And that is all that matters. Huh? Hey. Mario. Why are you listening to me? Oh, alright. Well, anyway, that is why I'm able to help you. If you get lost during your adventure, you can come to me. I can predict the path you should take for a small price. Right now, your main goal must be to save Princess Peach as quickly as humanly possible, but... According to my second sight, your path must first take you to the great fortress of the Koopa Bros. To reach the Koopa Bros fortress, head east on the road in front of a uh, toad house. Thank you, Dog. But I don't need your help. dangerous. Going to Koopa Bro Fortress would be a huge mistake. Definitely, definitely don't go. Most of all, though, you shouldn't go ask that old man Merlon for help. That would be really bad news for us. I mean, for you. Don't even think about it. Journey to the Cooper Bell's Fortress, you can travel there by following pleasant paths to the east of town. Path begins right next to Toad's house. If you have any problems getting started, please don't hesitate to ask for my help. Again, strange toads uh, blocking the east side of the road. That shouldn't be. That's ridiculous. Such a thing has never been heard of. Never. I'll get to the bottom of this. Follow me over there. I'll see what's going on. You took my five coins when, when that was the answer, dog. Are these the strange toads you were talking about? I told you that you can't pass. Take off. Hmm, you aren't toads, are you? Um, we don't know what you're talking about. Yeah, what gives? Ask anyone. We're, uh, we're just cute, ordinary toads hanging out. Reveal your true selves. Just as I thought, you're the Koopa Bros. How'd you guess it was us? We were perfectly disguised. Shucks. Black, yellow, green, we retreat. For now. Why are those imposters were none other than the Koopa Bros. You must pursue them to their hideout. The Koopa Bros Fortress. Oh, Mario, there's one part of your fortune I haven't revealed. To get to the Koopa Bros Fortress, you'll need help from a blue-shelled Koopa. This is a strange portent. Uh, in Koopa Village, you might find something that will clear it up. You must return home now. Deuces. 